Wow. And, and speaking of YouTube, our last speaker, last but not least, has over a hundred thousand views on YouTube because he's a social media specialist. But besides being a social media specialist, he's also the communication chair for the French Association of Professional Speakers. So ladies and gentlemen, our last speaker for tonight is Michel Poulaert, whom I uh, would like to introduce to you, you and have a great hand of applause. Yeah. For is an eternal optimist. Yes. Really, I don't know. Do you know those days where everything is going right, like today? Yes. <laughs> but do you know those days where everything is going wrong? But really, really, really wrong. You know? You know those days? Yeah. Yes, of course you know them. Well, imagine um, that this is a problem. Today I have a problem, and I have two choices. The first one is, well, I put it back where it come from because it's so insignificant. <laughs> but, but today I want to analyze it, to understand it. What is this problem? Well, it's little, but I want to know about it, where it come from. And I see, and I analyze, and I'm looking and I think, oh boy, it's a little bit too much for me today. So, you know, I'm optimistic, and I'm used to, to put it back where it came from, and I put it back. Where it came from? Yeah. <laughs> and I'm going through my life, but you know, the problem has another proportion. And the other day, I meet my friend, my dearest friend, and he's telling me, hey, something is going wrong with you. Now, I can handle it, it's okay. Well, do you want to talk about it? Okay, let's talk about my problem. And I'm talking about my problem, and he's telling me, oh boy, are you going through this? I've been there many years ago. Dude, you are in big troubles. Because what you don't know is that it's getting bigger, this problem. Well, don't lie, my friend. You know, um, I panic a little bit. I don't talk about it. You know the size of this problem? It's not the same again, but it's okay. I do like I always do. <laughs> and I'm going to my work like that. And my wife is looking at me and she sees me like that. <laughs> you know those days? Those days where everything is going wrong together, you know? And then <coughs> you are looking at this problem and you are thinking, it's the fault of this problem. And why me? Why now? Why? Why what I did to God to deserve this? Why? <laughs> well, <clears throat> I guess it's a little bit scary, but you know, I'm optimistic. I put it back where it came from. <laughs> and uh, in this situation, I lost my wife. She's gone with the children. <coughs> my dog bits me. <laughs> I lost my job. My, my car breaks down. You know, everything is going wrong. And, and why is this happening to me? And why? Maybe it's not the fault of the government. Maybe it's the fault of Obama. <laughs> Maybe it's the fault. I don't know, but it's not my fault. <coughs> <coughs> well, do you know what it is? We call this nervous breakdown. <laughs> Total burnout. And you know, I can't see anything. It's black in here. And you know what? I begin to suffocate. Well, an advice. Don't try this at home. It's done by a professional. <laughs> <laughs> and then, maybe I can take some medication. But I don't move anymore. I don't do anything. 
And the change can happen only when I realize that if I created this situation, maybe I can create a new situation. I have to find in myself my resources. Quite it's warm here. <laughs> it's warmer here than in France, you know. The problem is heavier than in France here. I don't know why. I have to find in myself some resources. I have to, to remember that a long time ago I had faith. Faith in myself. I succeeded. I was able to do some, some good things. And maybe I am the same guy and I have to do something else today. I have to change my perception, my focus. And I do something really, really crazy. I'm doing to do something new. Oh. Oh. I see people out there. Funny people. Happy people. You know, when you see happy people, well, it gave me more force, you know. And I have to try more. And remember, even if I lost my self-confidence, that can go that can go can can I go out this problem? Well it's not done because from here I have a long way to go. But my healing process is on a good way. Mm. And you know what? When I find the force in me, the force, you know the force. Yeah. I find the energy. I can do this. And it's difficult, you know? Because this bag is hard, you know? And I can go out this bag. Maybe with friends. Maybe with loving people. But the change has to come from inside. I have to do this job first. But the story is not ended yet. You know, I'm happy. I'm proud of me because I solved this problem. You know those moments in your life when you solve problems, you went stronger. And the story can go further. You know when you got out some problems and you look at the positive way and keep keep having the faith. I can remember that other afflictions in my life, maybe I can transform them to make something stronger. It is my other afflictions. It is my newer affliction. And I can think, what can I do? What can I do so positive? Let's do something. Let's try something new. Well, I transform this problem and create some new situation. And then you too. Oh, that's nice. Yay. <laughs> and now I can sing in the rain. Thank you. <laughs>